This is an ID later kind of click beetle. <laughs> they have overlapping body parts there that allow them to click when they are upside down and that causes them to flip over and you can imagine that if they were crawling right side up the predator came along and was bothering them they sort of play dead but then they're also capable of doing that and that helps them if you imagine them to be on a tree branch or something that allows them to escape their predator just kind of kicks them off into what seems like a very random direction and they're able to get away. If, you, if I'm very quiet, you can hear it clicking. And that doesn't hurt the animal at all. One of the coolest beetles in the United States, if you ask me. And then also in here, I've got some Bess beetles, also called Betsy bugs sometimes called patent leather beetles. And perhaps if we're quiet here too, we can hear them making some sounds. They make sort of hissing noises, but science has determined that these insects are capable of making what is believed to be more sounds than any other insect species. I think that's the fact, pretty cool looking beetles, good sized, very easy to care for. They just eat decaying wood in nature. They're found in logs and uh, they're communal. I have some older clips of the life cycle of these beetles. Take a look at that here right now. These are best beetles. Can you hear the little noises they make? Apparently they can communicate through 17 different sounds. That's old information, it may have changed. Pretty good sized beetles, long lived, not too difficult to care for in captivity. They eat rotting wood. Here's some, a pupa, and this one here very recently emerged from its pupation little fragments there. Uh, another pupa, and these are the larvae. Very interesting beetles. Take some close-ups here of this best beetle, very hard-shelled. Not able to flip itself over using the same mechanism as this click beetle did. See that the click beetle has all of its legs tucked in here so that when it does fly off it doesn't damage itself with legs sticking out everywhere. Need to hear all these beetles squeaking in here. to hear them squeaking. One of the other cool things about them are all of those fine hairs on their legs. Lots of insects have those. These ones, it's more pronounced and I think it looks really quite nice, like a pair of boots, metallic orange. They're called CT and they line the antennae there too. People sometimes ask if these beetles can bite because they do have a, sort of an impressive set of mandibles on them. But it's not something that you need to worry about. I've never been bitten. I 
feel like <laughs> you could hear the click beetle because I put my finger on top of it. Um, I feel like uh, they couldn't bite even if they wanted to. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up and please subscribe and hit the little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching.